again with our next installment of really progressive urban artists, the best urban artists in this country. And I'm a massive Whitaker fan, I'm a massive Pam Blue fan, a massive Findac fan, Kagar, all of them, I love them. And it's a great collective. This is the new inspiration of the piece that I wanted to do, based on the way that we've taken a lot from Africa and uh, I wanted to put something back in. So welcome to the lockup. Enjoy yourself. Some great people here tonight. We love you. Art is for everyone. Peace. and I'm at Red Bull Studios in London Bridge for the Lock Up 2 Behind Bars. God's child. What time? It's a portrait of Lennon and a portrait of Bowie and there's a connection between the two. They wrote the song, uh, the David Bowie song, Fame, together. I've actually put some clues on the back of the canvases but obviously only the person who reads, who buys the canvas is going to see that. Well, that is blowing my mind, this piece here. Um, I, it's my first time coming back to look at it. I know about Goldie's work from the 80s, and but this is a, a, an evolution um, that I never expected, and I'm, it's, uh, I want it. <laughs> We've got the real kind of gritty um, Goldie and Mau Mau graffiti stuff right the way through to the David Whittaker stuff which is much more kind of classic looking as such a big range and so much diversity. I just think it's the best body of art I've, e I've ever represented and all the artists at the moment that we represent are doing great guns like Dan Baldwin's front page of Art of England, David Whittaker's just won the National Open, 2,500 artists uh, entered that competition and David Whittaker won it. Pam Blue's work is uh, just sold for $20,000 in auction. So every artist that is under this umbrella is, is excelling in every, uh, every field. Yeah. 